G'day, night time here. Today I'm going to put together or show you how to assemble an illusion made out of paper. This, oops, there we go. So this is going to turn to a fairly awesome illusion. I'll stop the tape now and come back to you after I've actually cut it out. See you soon. Okay, here we have it all cut out. I'll just take it out of there. If only uh, cutting out things was uh, that easy all the time. As you can see, I've left the instructions here so I know which way to fold. Just a few more cuts to make. One more. So I go here. Not very easy doing this upside down. Or at least a way in which you would normally do it. So you see, you have to cut all the way from here to the white dot which is there. Now, let's do a bit of folding, shall we? So we fold along here. Now that's called a, a mountain fold because coming up. There are several here which require um, valley folds which fold it the other way. So another mountain fold here. So do try to be fairly precise. Okay, here. And so on and so forth. The, just follow the instructions on the paper. This one's going to be a value fold, so it actually folds up that way. So you can see they work like that. These tabs are mountain folds, so they fold in. There's, there's that one. It can be a bit fiddly. And, whoops. Need to make another cut along this area there. So far we've got okay, right, out here side. The video seems to be fairly blurry. Oh, can't do much about that now. Okay. See where it cut up to these um, the white dot there. It's another mountain fold. So it's a bit fiddly. And the same here. So far, oops. So currently it looks a bit like that. 
Uh, just going to stop it for a second. Okay, back again. Just uh, had to um, pre-fold so I had it round the right way. With the ears, you want to fold them back. Like that. The neck here, or the top of the head area, or the bottom of the head area along there, you want to fold as a belly. Eyes along here, fold as a belly. Under the eyes, mountain fold. Just in front of the nose, a valley fold. So, look at edgeways. It'll look something like that. Now, there are several ways of putting all this together. Some people use a glue stick. I'm using some sticky tape. So, I guess some sticky tape. Now, this is the base area. So, I'm just going to put some sticky here yeah it can be a bit fiddly so sticky tape right here so you have the base you can be a bit more, you can also sticky tape the actual to that as well. Sticky tape that area there. Sticky tape this area along here. It's all nice and neat. Now, all these folds should be fairly sharp, including the ones up. Oops. Let's just move this up a little bit. So, the, all the folds should be fairly sharp. Oops. So, you can see that. Now, I'm going to stick the uh, dragon's head together. Make sure it's all. Um, basically, make sure that there are no white bits showing on that side. And that one. So it looks pretty ratty on that side, it looks like. A bit like K9, I guess. <laughs> and the front of it should have the. Um, you shouldn't see any white bits from that. So, how does this illusion look? Okay. This is, the, this is what the drone looks like from the other side. See, it's all plain, nothing exciting. Then I turn it around, and all of a sudden, the dragon is watching you. Quite an interesting effect, I think.